<laughs> Are you crazy? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. In less ten videos, we haven't had a feeding video. Let's change that. As usual, you see, I prepared a bunch of different enclosures, and some of them we are feeding for the first time. Uh, these two and I believe this one they are new ones that I unboxed recently so this video is kind of special and also one more thing once again we have the special feeders in this one and I haven't shown you these these if you remember these are the hissing roaches from my friend this actual enclosure is from my friend that gave me those roaches in last video together with these they are also his tarantulas the reason why I have these he went to US to work for a couple of months and in the meantime he needs someone to take care of his enclosures and that is where I step in and of course even though he keeps these as a pets not as feeders they started breeding like crazy you can only see some outside but there is ton of them inside in short way too many and he needs to reduce that number a bit so yes again we will have that uh, hissing sound in the feeding video which is in last video I said that I kinda don't enjoy it because it kinda sounds like they are screaming but a lot of you didn't care about that and just enjoyed the feeding video so uh. so we'll actually start from here we will take one and we will feed this Pezzolteria Rufilata female if she doesn't bolt yeah she's still there <laughs> and unfortunately the power supply that supplies these lights it broke down so I don't have lights on this shelf at this very moment but I think that we will see what is happening, right? Right. So let me just grab one big one. I think this one will do. Oops. <laughs> sorry guys, sorry guys, sorry guys, please, please. Psst. And it will be over in a second. Or not. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> I thought that she won't take it, but yeah, she took it anyway. Oh, hello. Yeah, the lighting here is not really good, but it is what it is now. But yeah. <laughs> See you later, big girl. And I think that we can feed this one. This is the one that recently escaped. Uh, Pezzalteria Sufusca. But first I will try to see if she's interested. Oh! <laughs> yeah, she is. Coming, coming, okay, okay. Oh! Got it. I mean, you didn't see that much, but yeah, there is she down there. Actually, now we have a pretty good look, minus the the low light. <laughs> and to be honest, I'm not sure if I ever fed this one on the video, but I might be wrong, though. <laughs> she is struggling with that roach, and the roach is struggling for his dear life, as always. Oh well, let's continue with this. Just need to put back this cork. Now I don't see that any other is outside, so let's head back to the table. And I will also take the roaches and put them here. And now we can start with these. Also, in case you hear the water dripping, it is this pipe. It's coming from the AC. It is starting to be really hot here, so I need to lower the temperatures. Since this girl is already outside, I think that we can start with her. This is Tapinohenius violaceus. Pretty, pretty female. But she's kind of in the shade now. I will try to rotate the... Eh, much better, much better. You see how pretty she is? She's super pretty, pretty. So one smaller roach for her. This one is not that much small, but it will do. Whoa, oh, she took it down so hard. Oh my God. We always get sweet takedowns from this girl. And awesome fang action, look at this. Whoa, this angle is really nice. Oh, did Roach actually beat the tarantula a bit? Yeah, he's definitely trying, you see? He's going for her fangs. What are you doing, Roach? I mean, yeah, I understand what you're doing, fighting for survival, but... Don't hurt my tarantula, please. You see his mandibles? They are pretty large. Whoa! And this is actually a small one. <laughs> now imagine on the adult. Those mandibles are actually huge. And now it was actually biting his own legs. I guess the... The weather is starting to kick in. Anyhow, this was really sweet takedown. 
way to start the video. I mean, this is not the first clip, but the first clip on this table for sure. <laughs> yeah, let's carry on. The next two will also be Arborio Tarantulas. And these are, if you remember, the ones that I recently received from, from a subscriber from Zagreb. These are both males. Avicularia, I mean Caribena versicolor male to be more precise. And we also always get sweet takedowns with these guys. Plus they are also extremely, extremely pretty, you see. <laughs> Let's get a roach. Where are you going, pretty guy? The dinner is coming. No, you are not interested in this roach? Oh, no, 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 he is. That was also a good takedown, but Papino Henius Violatius female gave us a better one, I think. What a ball of fluff this guy is. <laughs> awesome. And check out her. <laughs> nice shot. Uh, the roach is trying to get away, but I think that it is too late, buddy. Too late for that, definitely. Now let's feed the second one. The second one is also a male Caribena versicolor. Although he's hiding down there, so let's try to lure him out. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Jesus. Whoa. <laughs> Are you crazy? This is sweet shot, but kinda too close for my taste. So let's move this away. <laughs> and I'm getting a roach, just a second. Roachy, roachy. Maybe slightly too big, but it will be fine. <laughs> you see, his abdomen is really small, so he needs a nice meal. Whoa, so cool. <laughs> and these smaller ones aren't hissing as much, so it is, it is much better, to be honest. Look at this now, both of them in shot. Together with Tapino Henius Velatius female. Now we will take some smaller specimens. One is the species that I want, want to update you on, not this one. The, yeah, this one, Gramostola Pulha. I just want to show you how big she is. I mean, how small she is, but honestly, she's growing at a decent rate, much higher rate than I originally expected. You see, she's not that small. Hey, hey, little guy, little girl, whatever you are. <laughs> so we need one small roach. Here comes one. Oh, no. Where did it go? Of course, right there in the hole. Not cool. No, 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 that's, that's a teaser. Come on, let it go. Please. Please, you don't need that. <laughs> Look how she's holding it. Stop. I will get you a new one. Look, here is one yummy yummy. One yummy yummy. Hmm, this one is actually too small. Maybe this one? Yeah, this one will be. Ah, this one is too big. Can't I find something in between? All of them are either too small or either too big, so... This is kind of... Oh, oh, too big, but... It is not a problem for this fuzzy little guy. Oh, come on, let go the tweet. <laughs> Crazy. There we go. Took it down without any problem with the knees even though it was kind of too big but yeah i want to feed it a bit more so it grows a bit faster because you know that they are really slow growers so we need to keep this mouth full all the time <laughs> now we are approaching the the one that causes the most stress to me personally that hilobrahi species sling from last unboxing video that I nearly lost. It is, you see, I don't know if you can see the abdomen right there. It made a lot of webbing, so that is a good thing. Hopefully, she will stay inside. Okay, looking good so far. And she also looks hungry, you see, she almost went for the tweezers. You mean, mean, mean little fella. No, it is starting to bolt. That's not a good thing. The roach is here and the rancho is here. Let's see how that will end. It looks like I will need to add a bit of motivation. Oh, yes, actually a good clip, who would have thought? She pulled it inside of her dark den. <laughs> now I will take another tarantula that we unboxed in last video. Actually, another tarantula, a spider. Lignotele megateloides. And look how many web. 
I mean, look how much they did web. You see a lot, and down there it's the spider. I don't know, I would like to throw it in the middle of this web and hopefully the, the spider will come outside. Hopefully. Blip, 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 blip. Come on, Rovich. Start struggling. There we go, okay. <laughs> you need to go over the... Oh, oh my god. It actually broke the web to get it. Whoa, this was a sweet, sweet takedown, right? Will you come outside maybe? Yeah, come, come. Fang action. Oh, this is, this spider is so pretty. I cannot believe how pretty this spider is. Ah, oh, beautiful. And these spinnerets, I just want to poke them a bit. <laughs> Whoa, don't fall, dude. Nice, I wonder how old this female is. I have no idea, but I think that she's at her maximum size. Well, thank you for the sweet takedown and for showing off like that. All of us really appreciate that. Whoa, whoa, she's going crazy a bit. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> we love it, right? Heck yeah! Heck yeah! Now, next one. The Pterinochilus, Pterinochilus Hordatus. The cool one, you know? The one that always dance. You remember this one, right? Well, check it out. It molted sometimes, I have no idea when, but she doesn't look that fresh, so I think that she will be willing to take down one roach. So we are going to try it out. Here it comes. Oh yes, of course that she is willing to take it down. She is always ready to give us sweet, sweet, sweet shots. Look at this. And I bet you that we are getting a happy dance. We just need to give her a moment or two. And you will see, a happy dance is coming, trust me. So far she never failed me, so I hope that this one changed now, right girl? Come on, start with that booty. I don't see enough movement down there. <laughs> Oh, but I see movement down here. I mean up here. Why are you stopped now? <laughs> Maybe I should open her enclosure just in case. No happiness? Uh, oh! I saw spinnerets move, but that was about it. Come on, let's do it. We need those sweet moves. Get that booty shaking. That's an order. Imagine someone listening to this conversation without the context. He would be like, what the hell is going on down there? Well, to be honest, currently not much. Enough of munching. Let's move a bit. Just a lot of munching action. It looks like this will be the only thing that we will get from her. Oh no, and just when I said that, she never disappointed so far. What can you do? What can you do? We are going to take another tarantula and hopefully in the meantime the situation will change. Now with this one we need to be super careful because you maybe recognize this one. Yeah, this is also the one that almost bolted away from the table in last unboxing video. Thankfully I had very nice reflex and she was caught on time. So let's see how fast she is with takedowns. And hopefully she won't freak out. Oop. Oh no, looks like she is not done for that shenanigans. So maybe better I, I don't trust her. No feeling clip from this girl, better luck next time. Oh look, she actually moved and I think that she also moved. I'm not good at spotting this stuff. But we still have two tarantulas left, so maybe there is still a chance. These two are the same species. It is a Gramostola pulchipes male and a female. First we will try to feed the male, of course. That same roach. Go! <laughs> no escape for you, buddy. Sorry about that. So far this male is extremely good eater, which you can tell by the size of his abdomen. And I'm actually trying to feed them a bit more than other tarantulas, because we need hubba hubba time with female, but he's still not mature, so we need to change that. Oh, there is a lot of dust here. Whoopsie. <laughs> I'm not good with cleaning dust. She is really big, you see? Since she molded, she never ate, so hopefully one big roach will be good. Don't refuse this big roach. I will just put it here and 
Hopefully. Oh, ho, 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 ho. whoa, 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 whoa. Let's move it a bit closer. Oh, it's, it almost looks like I'm, I'm grabbing it. <laughs> I didn't intend that. Sweet, this was also awesome takedown. And the roach, unfortunately, is making a lot of noise. Yep. Where are you going? <laughs> oh, look. There we go. A happy dance. <laughs> the roach, as you see, on the ground. And she's actually webbing the roach up. That way, while she's eating it, it won't like fall apart or anything. It will continue to be in one piece. That's why she's webbing it up. Hey, you're going pretty far away from it, you know that. She will go back and take it, don't worry. And where is this girl? Yeah, she's standing now. I must say that in this video we had a lot of really nice takedowns. Oh. The final struggle, I guess. Yeah, a lot of nice takedowns. I'm really, really satisfied. <laughs> what are you having? <laughs> Look how she's working. Look how she's dancing. Yeah, disco queen. <laughs> now she stopped. And this girl is just... She's not sure where she wants to go. Hey, 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 no, no, no. Don't go outside of the enclosure. Hello. Stop, go back. <laughs> Okay, now I need to close all these enclosures and we are done with this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I certainly did. If you did, yeah, if you did, thumbs it up and comment something. If you want to support this channel even more, there's a Patreon page. If you're new to this channel, make sure to subscribe. I upload every Monday and Friday. So see you again soon. Bye. -bye.